Hi, I'm Bob, and this is my No Shortcuts Corner. Today we're at the Riverside store at Runtex, talking to various people about what keeps them going and keeps them on track and keeps them fit. Uh, my name is Elizabeth Sherman. I'm a health educator, and what that means is that I work with individuals and corporations to teach them about their healthy lifestyles. So I'm a nutritionist, I'm a personal trainer, and I'm also a wellness coach. About three years ago, I actually was working in the corporate world, and what I did was I was a business analyst for a computer software company, and I was wondering, you know, how am I going to make this world a better place? And through my passion of uh, fit, physical fitness, um, I decided that I wanted to help other people become healthier. The reason that I really wanted to do that was because when I moved here to Austin eight years ago, um, my mom actually passed away from breast cancer. Uh, watching her die was actually one of the most horrible things that I could ever imagine and I didn't want to put myself through that and I also don't want anyone else to go through that process either. So if I can save one life, um, I will have done my job. I prefer to exercise first thing in the morning. Um, you know, research has shown that it doesn't really matter if you work out in the morning or after work or at lunch as long as it works within your schedule. I find that it works best for me first thing in the morning because at that point then um, I've got it out of the way and other commitments don't come up throughout the day to get in the way of my exercise. And so typically what I'll do is I'll actually go for a run. Um, and then because I'm a personal trainer and a nutritionist, I have a little bit more flexibility in my time. Uh, so I do run for about an hour each day, um, anywhere from, you know, six to seven miles per day. I stay on track by setting up goals and my goals actually change over time. Uh, so for instance right now I'm really into running but there was a time when I was very into strength training so I was doing strength training every day and then there was another time that I was doing a lot of Bikram yoga and so what I find is that if I can challenge myself in one of those different areas and try and find out oh how can I do that for instance um, if I want to get stronger if I want to, um, if I'm really into weight training at the time, I might set a goal of I want to be able to bench press 100 pounds. How do I, you know, make myself stronger? And as I said, right now I'm really into running, so I'm always trying to figure out, you know, how far can I go, or you know, uh, you know, how fast can I run? Thanks for visiting the site, and remember, better health is through community.